Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be playing a new game that just came out. This is called Lawn Mowing Simulator. Um, we'll play with the tutorials. Okay, company name. Um, it doesn't let me fit the G, I guess. The logo. Uh, do something like that. Try and do this quick. Avatar, let's do uh, something like that, maybe. What? Change our hat. To, uh, I like the black one actually. Auto placement. We do both front and back. Uniform color. Okay, this is the side color. Oh, it's black. And primary. Something. Grassy, I like that green. Okay, we're good here. We did the company, the logo, and the player. Alright, test drive. So I looked at these just a little bit before I got into this, but it looks like these first three are rear wheel drive. A lot of the other ones are either um, rear wheel turn or four wheel. And they have a few different mowers. And then it starts you off with looks like 3,000 whatever this is. I don't know if that's actually a type of money or just the end game, but we're on Monday, March 1st. Um, this is the cheapest mower. It's got a little smaller deck size, it's got a collector in the back, whereas this one doesn't. Uh, it's got a six, 6 liter fuel tank, this one's 5. We got a little higher top speed, and then we got a hopper capacity, so I think we'll go with this one for now. And see what this game's all about. All right, so let's check this out. What do we got? Hmm. So I'm just gonna try and get get a hang of the the game here. Okay, got a hold X. There we go. Turn. I can't really, uh... Oh, it's got inverted controls. I think. So we have to cut the grass at certain heights. And it says it'll have like a progress bar. Okay, so you just push up or down to get it into the uh, cut height. Right now I have that lower setting just to kind of see what, what we're working with. Let's bring it up one. So this is the tallest and the shortest, the difference in blade height. So you can definitely tell that.
But I think we got control for the basic uh, elements of the game. So I was thinking it has more of an adjustable throttle. But it looks like it's all the way down and all the way up. Alright, so it's telling me I have completed enough of this area. So now I can... It says I have to reverse onto the trailer. I'm wondering if that's true. It must be our grass clippings. Oh, can we empty it? Maybe I have to reverse. I don't know. Warning, reverse the vehicle toward grass bag to empty the collector. Oh, there we go. Okay. It says to reverse on the trailer. But it worked. So after completing the test drive, we can now purchase the vehicle, or we can test drive the other one. Um, I don't know which one I'd want. I think we'll just stick with this one. It is the cheapest one. It has a hover. I don't know if we have to pick up the grass or anything, but we'll do that. Now we can select a contract. Okay, so it looks like we only have one contract, which is uh, complexity of one. Uh, it'll give, you, give us 50 RP, which must be some sort of uh, like ranking token or something. $330. Okay, so once you uh, select the contract, you can see information about it. Looks like you can have employees and have them do it as well. That's interesting. So we only have one employee and one vehicle. So we need to complete 99% to, to complete this, I guess, if that makes sense. So it's got a recommended deck width of uh, 100 centimeters. What is ours? 84. We're a little bit small, but... Um, contract type, general cut. Grass range, 13 to 20. That was, that's the thickness or whatever. Cut height, 5 to 6. Ground check, 4 minutes. What is that? Recommended cut time, 26 minutes. Hmm. Alright, we'll try this. Also can review the oops. Review the stuff or start it. So I gotta review it again though. So five to six. Alright, let's do it. Oh it tells you again. Gives you a little overview of the property. At the start of each contract you have a small period of time where you can remove any objects that could be Oh, it could damage their property or ours. You can choose to skip the ground check and have the objects automatically removed. But this will mean you don't earn money or RP. Oh. That's weird, the controls got inversed again. I really can't fix this. Who's got a gnome? Oh, looks like we found something. And some, uh, Toys it looks like. Mm. 
Okay. I think we're going to try and take it kind of slow around all the edges. And try and get that done first. This actually looks easier than the uh, test trap we were on. I just feel like it's got a little extra space. Shorter grass. Oh, man, I can't see anything. Shorter grass and less thick, which is going to make it a little easier. Yep, we just went over the flowers. Missed a little piece there, so... I should have gone a little slower. Paid a little bit more attention. And uh, I think we'll come back and get this part. We'll just try and get the outside. And those overhanging bushes really make it hard to tell if you're getting it all. So I just damaged the blade when I turned into that thing. I think coming up here is where we screwed up. Yeah. Went a little too fast into that and took out some flowers. This is pretty satisfying actually. I'm sure if I uh, did a better job it would be even more satisfying. But trying to get all the blades of grass. I'm also trying to get it within the time limit. Which might be a mistake, I don't know, we'll see how far we get, but... We got pretty close to maxing it out there for... the engine... or blade or whatever, overwhelming it. I think I'm just going to cut this part off, actually.
I lied, I think I'm spending more time cutting that around. And I think I could be making a few more trips around this thing. I'm trying to clean up some of the edges as I see them each time I go around, but I don't know if we'll end up getting them all. Yeah, 40% of it. Oop. Got to redo part of this. Overwhelm the blade there. We're at 40% cut. It's not too bad. this you know before I get too far into it and forget. There we go. That was close. It's a nice little cottage house. Overwhelm the blades again there, or engine, or whatever. So that part's a little thicker there in the middle. But the outside of this is nice. The inside, we're still going to have to uh, work around the trees and stuff. We haven't got those yet. Almost done with this little square here. Doesn't look the best, but we're just trying to get it mowed and make some money. Rank up. Get a. You actually can have like different garages, which give you more spaces for lawnmower and employees, I guess. Which is pretty cool. So it's sort of a business, not just uh, you, you know, mowing lawns. Next pass, we're going to be cutting real close to some of these flowers. Oh shoot. i got to watch closely, it's like the third or fourth time we've done that now. I'm just going to knock this out now, so that next time I can uh, skip going around this side. Oop, got a flower. Alright, we got it two-thirds cut. We're at 12 minutes. 
so we're doing pretty good. Oh, that was not what I wanted. I get this the wrong way every single time. We're going to try and get close to these flowers and knock this one out as well. There we go. I don't know if you guys can see that couple of blades sticking up right there. I wonder if you get more money based on the amount of time or not. I know it has a time, like, goal. But, say you take 24 minutes compared to 28 minutes, like, do you, do you make any more money? They're both under 30. Or maybe that was a bad example, because 26 minutes is the, uh, the, like, goal time. Yeah, if you get 23 minutes or 24 minutes, they're both under 26, do you get paid the same? Or, you know, if you get 20, uh, 28 minutes or 29 minutes, is that paid the same? They're both under 30. Or is it just, if you make it under 26 or make it under 30, like, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, there we go. Look at all that grass we just missed on that last pass through, though. And some more there. I think I'll just clean some of that up. Ground damage. Destroyed some of the grass by turning your vehicle at full lock for extended periods of time. Hmm. Oh, that sucks. So I guess we can't uh, turn at full speed, which makes sense. So I think we've taken out two flowers, and uh, or maybe more than two flowers. Flowers in two separate instances for sure. this little bit. We have two flowers, or two separate instances of flowers, and we did some ground damage. Our blade did get damaged when we hit that one flower. I think we took out part of that plant. And we're almost done. We are at... 18 minutes. Well, 19. Okay, I 
think we got everything. Maybe we missed a little spot here. And it looks like a little bit there too, but whatever. Damage the blade making that cut there, so I think it looks good. First job complete. Get back on the trailer and get out of here. First, you gotta empty the grass out. And it says reverse, but we'll try and go forward. And it worked. Oh, there's a blade of grass right there I just saw. Other than that, it looks pretty good. Yeah, I don't see anything here. It'd be funny if they showed exactly uh, where we mowed those flowers over. Alright, so our ground check time. We did get $5.74 from that. Anyways, the $20... Oh, we got a time bonus. So we got $20 from doing it and five seventy-four from the time bonus. Cutting time bonus. Okay, so there is a time bonus. Oh, you can recover valuables. Penalties and fines, we got 9.77. Flowers destroyed, it's 4 bucks. Collisions, 575. And ground damage, 2 cents. <laughs> really? 2 cents of ground damage? What well, did I take out? 2 blades of grass? Come on now. Huh? Alright, so looks like we got 68 RP. And we now have, uh, Eleven hundred and eighty-seven point eight one dollars because we gained three hundred and thirty-six point eight one. Okay, so when you damage your vehicle and stuff or blade, you can uh, fix it here. Let's see, you can use statistics, purchase attachments. That's cool. Part exchange vehicles. Not sure what that means. Maybe you can use multiple parts across different vehicles. But there's our what is it? Tiga? Taiga? I'm not sure what the brand is on that. Let's see. Vehicle maintenance. So a full repair would cost us 71 cents. We'll skip that for now. Engine repair, 62 cents. Skip that as well. Well, I suppose if, if a full repair is not much, the blade, 257, we'll skip that. Fill the tank. So our tank is pretty small. But we can choose how much to refuel it, so we don't have much money. $1.85 for full refueling, we'll do that. In, oh, you can empty the grass here, which we just did before we left. Alright guys, well let me know what you thought of this game. Do you want me to keep playing more of it? Put it in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch another video, there's a random video on screen and another playlist. Please be sure to share the video, like it, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications so you're notified when I upload. And until next time... Peace.